acupuncture was discovered in 2500 BC. Traditional Chinese medicine is huge, including practices such as Chinese herbal medicine, and acupuncture is one part of it. For most people, acupuncture is equal to a bunch of needles, but there are many other aspects which remain a mystery to them. In this video, we'll tell you all you need to know about acupuncture, so stay tuned till the end. But before that, subscribe to our channel and hit that bell icon so you never miss a video from Snow. How did the practice of acupuncture begin? Acupuncture originated in China. Unlike metal needles that are used today, long sharp stones and bones were used earlier in around 6000 BCE. The Yellow Emperor's Classic of Internal Medicine is the first known document that addresses acupuncture practices. Here the phrase Yellow Emperor refers to the Chinese Emperor Huangdi who is believed by many to be the developer of acupuncture. How does acupuncture work? Acupuncture practitioners believe that our entire body has energy flowing through it. This energy is called Qi. According to acupuncture theory, we have 12 main channels which represent the body's organs and its functions, and the body's Qi flows through them. What acupuncturists do is channelize this energy which leads to health and balance. Benefits of Acupuncture If performed rightly, acupuncture can be considered as a safe and effective form of treatment as there are hardly any side effects. It can help control some types of pain such as headaches and osteoarthritis. Therefore, it is recommendable to patients who cannot take pain medications. Is acupuncture dangerous? Like any other therapy, acupuncture comes with its own set of risks. These could include bleeding and soreness in the area of insertion or a collapsed lung if the needle is inserted too deeply into the chest or back. There is also the risk of unsterilized needles infecting the patient or an unlikely case of the needle breaking and damaging an organ. But these worst case scenarios do not overpower the benefits of acupuncture. What health problems can acupuncture treat? As time passes by, acupuncture gains the ability to treat more and more diseases and health problems. Some of them include neck pain, labor pain, lower back pain, headaches, asthma, menstrual cramps, addiction, and many other conditions. If you haven't already, would you ever try acupuncture? What information about the needle therapy surprised you the most? Comment down below to let us know. If this video helped you learn something new about acupuncture, give it a thumbs up and share it with others. Subscribe to our channel and hit that bell icon so we can keep helping you snow more. See you next Thursday.